everyone. Thank you so much for stopping in today. Big warm welcome to all the new subscribers to the channel. It is my pleasure to have you. Make sure you comment in the videos that you watch so that I can get to know you. And welcome back to all my current subscribers. Today's a giveaway day. Mystery boxes are back. I have one box and I have two boxes. And this is all the, oh, there's stuff flying around. All the products probably like April, May that I'm boxing up. I have one more box and then I'm going to start putting the products in a box and then anything I collect for June will be given away in July, probably plus a few other things because I have tons of brushes and palettes. So I will add to that um, to do the boxes so that everybody can enter. Um, just follow the rules in the description box. This is the medium flat rate box from USPS. These are partially packed. They're not fully packed yet because I'm going to be adding some items to it. Um, just to give you a quick little sneak peek into this box. Oh, I don't want anything to fall out. Oops, don't fall. A little sneak peek into that one. Like I said, they're not completely full. I have a few little things that I still want to add. And we'll just, let me see if I can... Uh, I don't know if I can pick this one up or not, but we'll just do a quick little, quick little scan. I don't know if you can see anything in there. Um, hopefully not, because you're not supposed to see too much. There are a good bit of palettes in these boxes. I'm not going to tell you how many, but um, just trying to get rid rid of the April and May products that I know I'm not going to use. I've had I had a huge stack of palettes. I went through them. I think I only kept two out of maybe twelve. 13 pallets so I behind me in one of the little plastic drawer systems that I had to get at Target ran out of room um, I have one drawer full of like brushes sponges some skincare tools and then one uh, drawer full of pallets that I still need to give away um, I'll see if my sister or my girlfriend want any and then I'll just add what's there what's left and complement the um, products that I'll be putting away for June to give away in July. But I wanted to at least, haven't done a mystery box giveaway in a while. Uh, this is two winners, so that each two people can win this. Just follow the rules. They're simple, simple, simple. Um, just be an active subscriber during the month of the giveaway. Uh, it really does help if you like the video, if you comment. If you can share it out on your social media, that's wonderful. That helps greatly when they see that. Have your friends come over and subscribe and they can enter the giveaway too. You have to be a subscriber. Um, in the description box, it does state, I have to be able to verify that you're a subscriber. Too many people were coming in, entering, never watching another video. And if they won, I had to let them win because it didn't say, state any different in the rules. Since uh, probably the beginning of the year, I changed that so that the people that are consistently watching can win. Um, not these pop-ins and pop-outs. Um, I still have people that try to do that. They think coming in uh, one day uh, in a month or two and watching, you know, X amount of videos is going to get them to be an active subscriber. That's not an active subscriber. Coming in once every month, every two months and block watching some videos. Yeah, well, that's still active because you're commenting. But when I can see that in a two minute span, you've commented on 10 videos. Did you really watch those videos or are you just coming in, commenting and leaving? So that's where I question that. But just to be an active subscriber, um, close to 2,100 subscribers. I would love to get there and continue to grow. Um, it really does, you know, does help with the watching the entire video from start to finish, including everything that pops up in between. Um, it helps me do these giveaways. Um, it really does. That's why sometimes I don't do them if the, um, AdSense is not there to pay for shipping. That's my sole purpose. I don't use that money for anything else. It goes right back in towards the shipping. Um, you know, anybody can go to Social Blade and see what you make. It's not accurate, um, but it's close. You know, you know maybe about 40% accurate, 50% accurate. I mean, if you make 50 cents a day, a dollar a day, it's not going to pay for much. The products are already paid for, which is my budget. 
it would be nice to at least cover the shipping um, so two people can enter. Everybody can enter. Two people will win. Excuse me. I misspoke on that. So let me give you the end date. I have my uh, date book here. Um, I'm not sure when this video is going to air, um, but this giveaway is going to end on Sunday, June 27th at 1159 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And my try to end my videos on Sunday. It's so much easier for me to keep track of when a video is ending. I can just look at my date book and say, like I thought six by ended the week before and it was ending the week after. So if I don't, and I list it in my date book and there's no other, generally, sometimes I do pop videos on Sunday, but that's the only thing that's sitting there. So it sticks out for me. Keyword, always a keyword. So for those that don't watch, are not gonna know the keyword. So be creative in your, in your comment with the keyword. I'm gonna use the keyword flowers plural just because we've been planning and doing all that stuff and summer's approaching fast june 20th or 21st i think it is uh for summer um i never plant anything till after mother's day because we have gotten frosts before mother's day and demolished gardens by planting too soon so i always wait till after mother's day i know we're not going to dip down below now we were in like the 40s so we had a cold spell, rain came through in a cold front, but now we're back up into the 70s, 80s, which is perfect for spring. So I'll use the keyword flowers as use it in your comment. Um, like I said, be creative. If you say flowers enter me, enter me you're disqualified. Um, don't give anybody the heads up as to what's going on. Um, let them watch the video and enter just like you are. So I appreciate every one of you, whether you've been with me from day one, somewhere in the middle, or just joined today. I treat everyone fairly and the same. There are no favorites. There are no, just no favorites, period. I don't even know what other word to use. When I do my giveaway announcements, I show you the process. I'm always uh, about transparency, showing you how it's done, who the winner's being drawn on the comment picker. Um, if you win three in a row, you win three in a row. I don't think anybody's done that, but people have won, you know, two within a couple month period. <clears throat> They're just lucky their name is being drawn. The more that enter, the less of your chance of winning. So if you're creative in your comment, then people popping in or just looking in comments aren't going to have a clue and they're not going to use it. Because I still have people that, you know, want to enter in the giveaway and they don't use the keyword. Well, they didn't watch the video. I don't pop the keyword up anywhere in the video anymore in case they're scanning. So be creative and lessen your odds instead of increasing your odds. So I appreciate, like I said, I appreciate every one of you. I hope you all have a great day and good luck to everyone who enters. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye now.